Here's the 2003 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. This will be a tour around the car, inside the car, and engine specs as well. Now it does have the retractable top, as all Rubicons do. Now first of all, this is a scale 118 model car by Maisto. And I'm reviewing it like it's a real car. It really isn't though. It's not a real car. Okay. Well, the MSRP of this car is $24,810. Now I'll show you the engine. Now the engine has these locks on it. Right here. Just pull them out. And lift up the engine. Okay. So this has a 4.0 liter Powertech inline six engine that powers about 190 horsepower with 235 pound-feet of torque. Uh, the top speed of this car is about 107 miles per hour, 0 to 60 in about eight seconds, quarter mile in about 16.5 seconds at 80 miles per hour. Fuel economy for this car about is 10 city, 19 highway, and 17 overall. The total miles you can get off uh, one fill up is about 361 miles. has part-time four-wheel drive. Okay, now we'll come into inside the car. Now these doors can come off. You can just unscrew them off. Now inside the car you have a four-speaker factory stereo with AM, FM radio, CD player, and CD changer. You have a leather-wrapped steering wheel, manual climate control, AC and heat, four-way manual cloth seats, folding and removable rear seats, and a remote tailgate release. Now this car has a four-speed automatic transmission. Now we'll come out of Cars fog lights, manual convertible roof, uh, clear plastic windows, halogen headlights, skid plate underneath the body to prevent anything to be scratched and severely damaged while going off road. You have a full down windshield. Removable doors, like I said before, hood locks, alternating front blinkers, and a diamond plate skid guards. That's what's on the bottom. Now for safety, you have a full-size roll bar, full-size rear mount mounted uh, spare tire, driver and passenger frontal airbags, engine immobilizer and ABS. Now for the off-road controls you have a command track four-wheel drive system. Four-wheel drive high, neutral, and low. Heavy-duty suspension, 50-50 walking front and rear differentials, and heavy duty 4 by 1 low gear ratio. Now we'll rev the Jeep.
Okay, I think that concludes it. So please subscribe, like my videos, from me on YouTube, and feel free to ask me any questions about the model car or the car in real life. I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks for watching.